Membership of the association include medical officers, consultants, specialists, pharmacists, and laboratory technologists. These category of public university staff are the frontline health workers. They are currently providing specialized services to contain the spread of COVID-19 in university and surrounding communities. Local and national president of the association, Kwame Yebwa Jr., reiterated the need for a concerted effort to contain COVID-19. Uh, well, the items are protective gear for the hospital staff. They include a gown and then face masks which they need to for their work. So those are the items that we presented to the hospital. And the uh, reason being that uh, we are part of the university system. Uh, we are the Ghana Association of University Administrators. And uh, in addition to teaching in the university, we have other services that run the university. And the hospital is one key search area. We have other groups that will deal with the works and development, our finances, the administration, the information technology experts also. So we feel the uh, our colleagues who are the battlefront as we, we, we find ourselves now as a country, we all cannot be at the battlefront. So we felt it was very important to support them uh, indirectly by presenting these items for them, to them so that uh, they save themselves from what are infections that might happen. Director of the University Health Services, Dr. Oseu Suansa, himself a member, thanked the association for the gesture and called for support for other groups. The hospital, I accept this donation for the Glad Heart and I wish to thank you very much. These, I see these are essentially PPEs, which are the tools we need in, in, in fighting against this COVID-19 war. <laughs> it will make an impact. The National Executive Committee of Gawa, comprising administrative, professional senior members of public universities, also made cash donation of 15,000 cities to the COVID-19 so Trust Fund. To respond to that. And then we made a regional minister Simon Osemensa received a check on behalf of the government. For Joy News, Kwesi Debra.